and the librarians here at the Pickerington Public Library will be showing you some science experiments that you can do or set up in 60 seconds. One experiment will be featured each week beginning June 16th and they will go on for eight weeks. I hope you have already come into the library to get your reading log for the 2014 summer reading program, Fizz Boom Read. I'm also here to remind you that with all the experiments we are showing you, it is strongly advised that you must have an adult with you present to supervise your work. Thank you and Fizz Boom Read. Hi, and welcome back to Science in 60 Seconds. Today we're going to demonstrate capillary action. This allows water to flow upward. Plants do this by pulling water from the ground. Today I'm going to demonstrate with a celery stalk and some tissue paper. We're going to pour some water in both of these cups. And we're going to dip the celery in there. And you can also take some food coloring. The plant stems act like straws, sucking up water through the tiny tubes to the flower petal. After a day's time, the water should rise up into the petal. And it will turn the flower petals red. Or in this case, purple. Now another way to do this, if you'd like to do it right away, is you take a piece of tissue paper, add your food coloring, and only water into one bowl. One there. Stick the tissue paper into the bowl, and as you can see, the water is sucking upwards. And you put it into the other bowl, and as you can see, it is transferring it into the other bowl. So after a day's time, the tissue paper will transfer most of the water into the second, the empty bowl. And that was science set up in 60 seconds. Wow, wasn't that experiment awesome? The librarians at the Pickerington Public Library are great. To find out more about more fun science experiments, here are some resources and some books that you can check out at the Pickerington Public.